Assalamu alaikum and welcome to the highlight by Hadia. I am, I was just film, I was just editing the video and I realized that I had not filmed the intro for the video and I thought I'd quickly do that because uh, the video seemed really weird without the intro. So yes, I filmed my sister getting ready for her farewell. I did her hair and makeup. I didn't record the entirety of her hair. I mean, there's a little bit of time left, but that's just the beginning of her uh, hairdo. And then there's a little bit at the end. You'll see how it is. You'll see it in a little while. Um, yes, yeah, so I hope you guys like the video. Please do let me know if there's something else you'd like to see. And um, you know, how do you think about this look? Do let me know in the comments. Okay, so enough talking. We're now going to get into the video. The faces she's making in this time lapse are hilarious. And I mean, I can't stop laughing at how she's looking through it all. And I'm really, really sorry for the for how horrible I look. But I was in my night suit and I just woke up to do her hair. She has a lot of baby hair, so I'll just spray them. Uh, so that they are not falling on her forehead and are up into her twist. I'll be using the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer to prime her face and I'm just going to spread it all over over her face with my fingers and uh, no, I have absolutely no idea why she's making so much faces but I, I mean I was pretty gentle but she's a cartoon so I mean I'm not surprised. You're supposed to cover your mouth when you're yawning, Zara. I mean, you're far more tired than you're supposed to be. It's her favorite. It seems like I forced her to be here. I, I promise I didn't. Anyways, I'm just priming her eyes now. And I'm using the Benefit uh, no, Erase Paste Concealer uh, in the shade number 2 Medium. And I'm just going to prime and set her eyes. And we shall move on to the next step. Okay, that is definitely very scary. I'm sorry for the excessive zoom in, but I wanted you guys to have a clearer view of what was happening on her eyes. Anyways, I dipped into the shade Feisty from the New Dude Palette Volume 2 and this will be my transition shade and I will be able to build upon it as it's a very, very soft and an easy color to add on the pinks to as you can see in the other eye. And my sister was making me listen to Niall Horan whilst I was doing her makeup. Okay, before I get copyrighted, I'll stop playing that music. Anyways, I dipped into the shade Flirty from the same palette and I'm going to deepen my uh, crease uh, by blending it into the transition shade and letting the magic happen. Next, I'll be putting on uh, Bossy from the Rose Gold palette by Huda Beauty and I'll first dab it onto the outer corner and then start blending it onto her crease to further define it and build on that color. Mm -hmm. Okay, next. <coughs> Bless you my child. She is absolutely not going to be happy that I kept that in the video Anyways, um, I'm just going to blend all of the outer corner just to make sure that there's no harsh lines And next what I'll be doing is I'll be dipping into moon dust and bay and swiping it across her lid so that She has a nice gold lid and it blends into her outer corner You guys must have noticed that her eyes are extremely hooded and I really really have to cut her crease so for that I'll again be dipping into my um, erase paste by Benefit and going to cut her crease and going a little above okay a lot more above her natural crease just to ensure that there's something visible when she opens her eyes and you know you can see my hard work yes that was my voice i was singing along to photographs i am sorry you guys had to endure that but i mean i was just living the moment Anyways, what I'm doing now is I'm patting on the shade Angelic from the Rose Gold palette and I am putting it right where I cut her crease. Uh, next, what I'll be doing is I'll be highlighting her brow bone 
using the shade moonlight and i'll be using the same shade to highlight her inner corner as well um if you guys are wondering what will i do with her eyebrows i won't be doing anything to her eyebrows because i still want her to have that uh like i don't want to overdo her face anyways using the shade chai from the rose gold palette i will be uh, i'll be shading her lower lash line i'll be uh, defining her lower lash line i don't know what's the right word but anyways i'll be doing just that and uh, yeah it was very hard because she kept on feeling very ticklish next thing is obviously the eyeliner and i'm using my maybelline master precise and yeah just going to wing it and hopefully keep it equal to the other eye which was a very hard task i had to sit on her lap hold her face and like honey we have to wing it perfectly as a result obviously i had to fix the other one because that one i was not at all impressed with and yep now you can clearly see me taking it off and redoing it I'm sure you all must have noticed the white spots on their face and I'm trying to I mean I was trying to take them off but they were not coming off. I don't know how my wonderful sister managed to put blanco on her face. Um anyways as you know we weren't going for an over the top excessive look I used a tinted moisturizer by Laura Mercier on her face and though it did help with the coverage just a little bit because I used a concealer on top and that did help but overall some of the spots were peeking through. and i'm just going to blend it all using a beauty blender and yeah i was hoping for the best but you can clearly still see the spots i haven't used the concealer yet so let's see what happens for her contour i'll be using the maybelline master contour stick and starting from the top of her ear and going halfway down her cheek uh next i'll be concealing her face using the makeup forever hd concealer and going under her eyes around her nose Uh, as well as a mouth i'm not putting the concealer right on every spot because i don't want one of her cheeks to have excessive concealer on and the other to not but when i'm going to blend i'm going to blend it in such a way that the spots are somewhat covered i'll be blending all of that product now and you know going to blend the concealer and the contour so that she has a nice flawless flawless finish and yes so blend 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 and next i will be using my color pop pressed powder face to set that contour and giving her that nice sun kissed finish and i'll be taking the bronzer slightly up into her temple so that you know there's a continuity on her face and not just that her cheeks are bronzed my sister has a very funny duck face going on but yes after bronzing her up i'll be putting on the blush and just going to blush bl just going to put blush on on the cheeks and she's scolding me right now that you know we're running late and you have to be quick but i'm like sit down girl we ain't done yet we got to make you look fly anyways um yeah so just going to put blush on on the cheeks i asked her to smile so that i know where her apples of her cheeks are so that's why the weird smile and rolling her eyes as well For her highlight, I used the shade Obsessed from the Jaclyn Hill palette, and I did spritz my brush with the All Nighter spray just so that you know there's that extra power factor in her highlighter. Uh, for her lips, I'll be applying the shade Icon from the Huda Beauty pa uh, from the Huda Beauty Liquid Lipstick Collection on the middle of her lips, and then on top I'll be using the shade Times Square from the ColourPop uh, Liquid Matte Lipstick on top. And after applying the color pop shade, I applied a third shade on top, which was uh, the Floma Silk Matte Liquid Lipstick in the shade six. Yeah. Hi guys, I just filmed a video with my sister. It's a favorite today. Not her favorite. She's giving a favorite to her friends. Uh, I'm in my night suit. I just woke up. She has an. an afternoon farewell so yeah this is what she looks like i'll just film as soon as she changes i'll make another video yeah you go so i completely forgot to record a video as soon as she was done you can talk in the video say hello to my few people who follow me hi oh god uh, she's my sister she's not my twin so please don't say that that she's my twin she's nothing she does not look like my 
there are a lot of people who are staring at us i think this is how you feel when you're vlogging um <laughs> should i vlog i should vlog yeah, i should vlog control. once um but this is how please. she looks this is her dress like yeah i'll i'll we'll do the standing up thing as well and i'll be posting the pictures on instagram do check them out and i don't i look like a mess i'm sorry i, I didn't dress up today but i i just attached the link uh, no, I just attached the video in which she's standing and you know she's twirling around. You want to attach the eye? Just like it come. It will come. Yes, it will. But okay. I have to let them know that it's gonna come. I need to tell them. Okay, so if you hadn't yep, I trained that they would have already been seeing shut it. Shut up. Uh, yep. So bye bye, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Do let me know what you'd like to see next. And yeah, look at the highlight. That's Jacqueline Hill palette, by the way. That's Jacqueline Hill obsessed on her cheeks. Yeah, I did. I love it. Oh, you gotta do posey, posey, man. Do the, do this and do that and do this. You can attach the pictures. Okay, yeah, I'll attach the pictures. She, she's not good at it at all. She's worse than I am. Anyways, bye, bye. Love you guys, and yeah, bye. And yeah, look, look. Why are we filming? Okay, look there. On, to, at the tree. Look down. Look up. You know what? You're ruining the makeup. You're ruining the look so bad. Okay, bus. Time out.